we're, we're making a documentary. <laughs> And this is my leg. The streets is what he knows. Talk about the one and only. Hi, everybody. My name is Matt Powers, and uh, I'm making the movie on John Comer. My name is John Comer, 26, from Garland, Texas. When I was uh, four years old, I got hit by a car. And I lost my foot when I was seven because of that, and then started skateboarding when I was ten. Uh, hi, my name is Brian Powers. I'm a executive producer for the John Comer documentary. <laughs> <laughs> first, I'll start off by uh, saying when I first heard about this, uh, I was going to school at UC Santa Barbara, and. Uh, Matt called me up one day and said, uh, I think I'm going to do a documentary on this pro skater. And uh, I'm like, fucking tight. Do it. Do that shit. Get down. Dirty. And then uh, he says he has a prosthetic leg. I'm like, what? I couldn't believe it. I was shot. This is it. It's got duct tape all over it to hold it together. This is the sticker I use. I usually try to use the same sticker for at least like four or five days. And then it's got to cover up the air hole so it can slide off into like a suction cup kind of, I guess. Like, it's pretty sick looking. Whatever. I think I had athlete's foot right there. I went to film school at UC Santa Barbara, and uh, I went to Powell, which is right behind us, right behind the campus, or like a mile away. I had an idea for a sequel of a movie they made in 87, and it was called uh, Search for Animal Chin. So I went in and talked to them. I talked to like George and Michael about doing the movie, and they said it just it cost too much money for what they could afford to do right now. And then uh, Michael suggested doing a documentary on John Comer. And I was totally down to do that. And so far I've been working on this documentary since June. Uh, today we went up to uh, North Star, did a little extracurricular activities, snowboarding, shooting some extra footage so we were later. All right, what we're doing is reenacting when Tony Hawk said that he took John snowboarding. I guess his leg was coming off on the lift. Tony said it would be funny if you saw the board fall off the lift and then go down the hill. So we're going to reenact it with the board going down the hill so that uh, we can cut it into Tony talking. I think it'll be a pretty funny scene. We'll see what happens. <laughs> I'm gonna use a Hyatt camcorder because it's old school, early 90s style. And that's probably what, when John went with Tony, it was the early 90s, so we wanna get the authentic film medium, or video medium, should I say. So, let's see how it goes. So John, I guess you'll just slide on your ass down there. Yeah, yeah, I'll meet you guys at the bottom. Okay, great. Las Vegas, come on. Las Vegas, come on. Las Vegas. How'd that first take go? Uh, it went alright, I guess. I didn't really see it until he was already halfway down the mountain. Today's February 28th. Uh, we got up early to shoot John Comer documentary. 
and uh, we put our cars in the, uh, the garage and we woke up to go uh, snowboarding again. It was a huge school bus. <laughs> huge. Number two, Route 77. License, license plate E00161633, 0, 0, 16, something like that. And uh, it's about 11.10 now, and we're still waiting. Some supervisor's supposed to be coming over. John's still hanging out. We're still looking at magazines, watching Price is Right, and whatnot, and uh, waiting to go boarding. So, <laughs> well, hopefully we'll get to go boarding sometime today. agendas in life, you know, and I was John Comer. <laughs> I went to Tony Hawk's house, and uh, we got to his house late, and he was there by himself, and he's, he just looked so tired. I'm not sure. He must have been a teenager, yeah. Was, it, was, was he tired? still an or was he even yeah. This is amazing seeing, like, a top pro skater and going to his house. That was pretty awesome. And then, uh, you know, just to see another celebrity. Plans for the future to keep on getting free stuff. Like these cool kicks, John Comer shoes, sig signature series. I got these for free. <laughs> for helping out. So they're pretty snazzy. Check them. Playboy. He has paid one cent for every shoe made. <laughs> I'm signing off, Brian Powers. There will be some sick skating. stories. Getting to know John as a kid, fuck man, you could not knock the smile off that boy's face with a 22 pound sledgehammer, you know what I'm saying? And uh, that's about that. I think it'll motivate people to like, you know, get their, whatever they gotta get done in life done, you know. My message to uh, the youth of today. Just give a great, go party, whatever. I don't know, whatever it is you want to do with, with your life. You should go do it because this is your only chance, you know what I mean? <laughs>